Hello, this is Sparkling Too Sweet uh, making this tutorial uh, regarding a salad challenge with uh, Von Seal TV. And yes, girlfriend, this is me in my natural look um, without my wig on, y'all. Yep, sister is gray. Okay, I did another big chop. I cut all my hair off. I had my son cut it off this time because it is so freaking hot down here in Arizona. And I am sitting in the house and got the central air on and I am sweating. Now here in Arizona, we don't turn, we, we, we use our central air, but when you live in a big house, you don't blast it because we are on a system that's called SRP, and it is a little chip box that we put a little, like, ATM card in. It's prepaid, and so uh, if you're at home by yourself, you don't run your air like crazy because it, it, it costs a lot. I mean, we are at basically $300 a month, okay, right now because it's been in the triple digits, and here in Arizona... It normally don't be, it normally don't have no humidity. It just all um, dry heat. And lately, uh, with the storms that's been going on in the upper Midwest and coming down through uh, California and Tennessee and Oklahoma and stuff, we are uh, we're getting some of that humidity. Okay, so. Um, I just want to um, send this video out to Miss Von Seal TV. Um, yes, I thought about, I got your video, and um, yes, I am now going to try to do this challenge for weight loss because I went to the doctor yesterday and uh, I, he put me on blood pressure medication. And, but it's at a very low dose, and um, I'm not really a pill taker or anything. I don't like that. Um, I haven't even really picked up my prescription yet, but I do have some here, but they're a little bit higher dose. But um, uh, I want to try to lose at least 10 pounds in the next three weeks because in three weeks I go back to work. I've been on vacation for... Two and a half months, I work for the school district down here. When the kids is out of school, I'm out of work, okay? So that's why I got such a long vacation. Um, I could have went and took another job, but my plans was to go out of town uh, for about a month, and um, that didn't work out. My car started acting up, so I said I better use that money to get my car fixed, okay? So, um, yes. I have purchased the Bragg's apple cider vinegar, and I uh, did uh, some research on it. I was consuming it last year. Um, uh, I, I consumed the whole bottle, and I noticed that it was a change in my appetite because, girlfriend, I demolished ice cream, okay? Ice cream and cookies or cake is my comfort food. Or just ice cream by itself uh, with the walnuts or pecans, drizzled chocolate or caramel. Whew. When I was going through my divorce, I killed some uh, ice cream, okay? And so that's why I have on this weight now. I believe... I am approximately, I think she said 208, I'm 208. My weight is going up and down, okay? Okay, I started to say why, I don't know, but as I thought about it, I do know because, you see that kitchen back there? Sister be cooking, okay? Let me give you a little bird's eye view. Sister be cooking up in that mood, okay? God bless me to move into this house. 
I don't live in here by myself. Uh, don't uh, get me wrong. I don't live here by myself. My son lives here. My niece and her husband lives here. And we all uh, go half on the bills. Okay. So I do the majority of the cooking because my profession is a sous chef. And my son, my oldest son, is an executive chef in his hometown. And we used to own the restaurant. Well, technically, he used to own the restaurant. But, okay, um, I helped him out in there. And I have been uh, doing an extensive amount of cooking all my life. So, um, my mother, she, she basically had a restaurant in her, in her kitchen. And she did own her house when... Uh, she was uh, uh, alive. So uh, that's why I got to cooking and eating. And, you know, like, I know I told you that we want to do this challenge, uh, salad challenge, and you recommended Monday. So I said, okay. But I did uh, go to the grocery store, and I posted that video, the little small haul. I did, I purchased some items from Walmart, and, um, no, let the, the romaine lettuce, cherry tomatoes, salad toppers, stuff like that, but I am going to barbecue this weekend, okay, because uh, I didn't did it, I had a jump start, and uh, all this week, I only been eating two meals a day, very small meals, and like this morning, I got up and had me a little small hockey puck croissant sandwich um, and um, it's about close to noon I believe I don't know what time it is oh it's 10.48 here and that's only been an hour ago that I ate that sandwich and I'm hungry already but I did drink my apple cider vinegar and I'm not extremely hungry but I can feel the difference Okay, so uh yeah, I said, I want to barbecue me some ribs and me the little drummy things and um, have me some beans. Beans is a good source of uh, protein. And uh, I don't think I'm going to have no potato salad. we probably get some coleslaw or something because I don't want no potato salad. Okay, so that's what the plan is for this weekend. And then Sunday... We're going to jump back into the salads. Okay? So, yes, girlfriend, let's try to lose 10 pounds in three weeks. Okay? And I am heavier than you. So, and you, I think that you're a little bit more active than me watching your videos. You know, you get now uh, going out and about. You know, I know you're not exercising uh, according to your videos. But, and... I was exercising, we was playing badminton, we was getting to work out three times a week, but since it's been getting hotter here, we have not been doing anything, okay? I do try to go and, uh, you know, go hang out at Walmart or Target, and I do me a little fast walking around there, or either I go to our local um, uh, mall, we have Arizona Meals here. And I'm pretty sure everybody got a meals mall somewhere. Um, and I walk around there. But my family, they slow. Everybody moves slow. So, you know, you just have to take off and leave people. So, okay. So I'm going to try to give you, oh, you can't see. Okay. I don't have my stand with me, so I don't know where to prop this thing up. Because the lighting in here is pretty bad. But as you can tell, I am chunky. Okay, I'm chunky. Yep, 212, I believe. So we want to get rid of that 12, okay, and make it an even 200. And I'm going to do it in the name of Jesus because it is too hot to be walking around out here fat. Okay, and so 95% of the people out here. They, uh, that's all they do is work out, jog, because this Arizona is a retirement state. Everything is slow moving, okay? So you can't do nothing but jog where you want to go and work out, okay? 
So, uh, yeah. Let's get this done, girlfriend. And uh, I'll be looking forward to your next video. And I do apologize for your breakup. Okay. But, you know, stay encouraged. Move forward. Because stuff like that happens. You know, men come a dime a dozen. They in, they out. You know, we find out that they're liars. You know, and sometimes you can look dead in their face. And you could tell that they lying. And then I found out, you know, years ago, if you calling your man and calling your man and calling your man and he ain't answering the phone or he got some long, drawn out excuse, baby, he doing something he ain't got no business. So you know what? Honey, just keep on moving because sooner or later, somebody else going to come along and honey, they'll love you just the same. Okay? Or either love you better. So, you know, just take your time. You know, you got your whole life ahead of you. You know, you appear to be that you're not that old. You know, I'm 56. So, uh, I don't think you're older than me. So, uh, Lord, I'm having hot flash. Oh. Yeah, I have hot flash too. But, you know what, just, just stay encouraged. You know, just stay encouraged. You know, keep yourself fixed up. Keep buying your wigs. Keep looking good, you know, for yourself. You know, keep treating yourself to stuff that you like. You know, you and your mom went to Las Vegas. You know, just keep enjoying yourself. Enjoy life. And don't let no man come along and bring you down, especially if he's a liar and he's a cheater and he's a schemer and conniver. Okay? So just enjoy your life, you know, because... I made up in my mind, honey, after what I went through with my husband. And I tried to love that joker for 25 years. And he just he just turned out just to be a hoe. He's just a downright hoe. Yes, I said it. Uh, across the United States, hoe. Okay? Now, mind you, he was a very good provider. Very good provider, but he just couldn't keep his little winky wink in his pants. So I told him, I'm like, are you free? You are free, honey. You are free to go and do whatever you want to do because as of me and my house, we going to serve the Lord because, baby, I do not want no man that is not my husband going to be laying on top of me, and he done been with the whole world. Okay? Let's keep it real. Let's keep it real. Okay? I just don't want that. I mean, if you if you got somebody, if they got somebody, just tell the truth about it. And then, you know, let, the, let, let that be the woman's choice if she wants to deal with that. Okay? Just tell the truth about it. But they don't. They won't. I try. I got three sons. And I try to school them, and mom, believe me, they try to school me, and they be pointing them out. They be like, Mama, that nigga ain't no good. He ain't no good. Move around. And sure enough, that is what it turned out to be. So, hey, you know, girl, be encouraged. Enjoy your life. Let's get this salad challenge on, and let's lose these 10 pounds, okay? All right. I'll talk to you later. I done went over almost 15 minutes, so I'll talk to you later, and uh, I'll wait for your next video. All right. Enjoy. Bye-bye. Oh, it didn't cut off.